Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November 29th of 2021. Well, it is titled the extraordinary spiral in LL Pegasi. So what do we see here? Well, this is an interesting spiral. This is not a spiral galaxy that we see off towards the left hand side of the image as we're used to looking at spirals. We know that this is actually a star. So this is a star likely at the very end of its life. So a star much like our own sun that is reaching what we call the phase of the planetary nebula. Now that occurs at the end of the life of a star like our sun in which the outer layers are expelled out into space and then uh, removed essentially removed from the star they become the star becomes unstable and pushes those outer layers off. And we see this as a planetary nebula. However, in this case, we get a very distinct spiral. And very interestingly, once we study as we study it, it appears that it's about every 800 years that a new layer is expelled, which very interestingly is very close to the amount of time it takes the two stars to orbit each other. So it's quite possible that these two things are actually related that it has to do with the fact that this planet this star that's forming a planetary nebula is actually a part of a a binary system. And that is why we get this unusual structure. Now we note that in planetary nebulae because we see that the planetary nebulae never look exactly the same. And we wonder if some of those more complex structures are due to the fact that many stars are in binary or other multiple star systems. And that may cause it to give different structures here. So here we may be seeing a planetary nebula just in the process of formation. And we see many others of these as planetary nebula is a very short phase of a star's life lasting only tens of thousands of years. And while to us that is a long time to a star like our sun, which has lived for 10 billion years, it's just a very short blink of the eye in terms of its life. So it's a very, very short stage. And we have to happen to catch those stars at just the right time in order to be able to see it. But here it looks like material is kind of swirling out, perhaps uh, affected by the rotation of the two stars around each other. As I mentioned, the two periods seem to match very closely the period of orbit of the stars and the period with which the layers seem to be being expelled. So quite possibly and perhaps future studies will learn help us to learn about this. And of course, we still don't know the details as to why we see this structure like this. Normally, we would not see this glowing until the core is revealed. And we don't see the core here. The core, the white dwarf star is what gives off ultraviolet light, which would excite the gases around it. So interesting to consider what might be causing these to glow. So that was our picture of the day for November 29th of 2021. It was titled The Extraordinary Spiral in LL Pegasi. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Planet with Moons. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.